Welcome to ICT Prolabs. In this video, we are going to show you how to authenticate Azure with Terraform using Visual Studio Code. There are different methods available. Here we are using one of method called Service Principle in Azure. For that, we are using Visual Studio Code Editor. Open the Visual Studio Code Editor. We are going to create a one file called main.df. Here we and the provider resource called Azure RM and we add the argument features. After that, we are going to create a block called Terraform and here we mention the source details. After adding this uh, Terraform block, we are going to create another file called variable.tf file. Under this variable.tf file, we are going to declare different variables. We are going to declare the client ID, client secret, subscription ID, and tenant ID. We are not adding default value here now but we will add later for better understanding we have to add description details for each variables and here we are adding a normal string called value once we finish this variable declaration we are moving to main.tf files under the provider block we are calling following variables as we declare the variable.tf file in that variables we will add the values later but we are calling uh, the client id uh, subscription id tenant id and client secret here after adding the uh, variable calls here we are going to open actual portal under the actual portal we are going to select actual active directory under the actual directory we select app registration blade for that we have to create a uh, new registration for application click on registration give the name of the application select the first option accounts in this organization directory only after that click register button once you click register it will create successfully application then we need uh, the tenant id uh, application id from here and uh, subscription id from azure subscription you have to copy from here and uh, save in the next we have to give contribute role for the application registration account for that we have to select a proper azure subscription and click the access control then we click add button click on add role assignment select the contribute role and then select the application registration name from here click on select button and uh, just type your description details if you want after that click review plus assign button once you finish this one go to app registration and click on the application Select the certificate and secrets from the application registration blade. Click on new client secret. Give the detail description details and expiry. Expiry we have different option. You can choose as you want. After that, click add button. Once you finish this one, go to the Visual Studio Code Editor and we are 
going to run terraform init then terraform plan after the terraform we try to run terraform apply but there is no changes why because we didn't add the, any attributes to the group in the terraform code now we are going to add a, a resource called a resource group and its name and its location We add the resource group name called resource gp-tfm and we are adding the location east us then we are going to run terraform plan after that we are going to run terraform apply We are running data forum applying. It will pop up for confirmation. We are going to click, we are going to type yes. We are showing enter value. We are going to type click S, typing S. After that, other resource group will be created in the Azure portal. For the verification, we have to go to the Azure portal, open the Azure portal, under the resource group, we can see the, uh, our resource, the resource group name. Hope this video is helpful. Thanks for watching.